Hey guys, this is D from Kerbal D. Crew here. I wanted to talk about an internet issue. I never really talk about or do news videos because I don't like to make scripts and it's not fun to write something down or even type something down. But you probably know of the competition between Battlefield and Call of Duty. Call of Duty usually wins because it's just a more popular game and more people like the fast pacedness of Call of Duty. But this year, something strange happened, and that's Battlefield 1 and Call of Duty Infinite Warfare. Um, if you look right here, currently Battlefield 1 has 1,707,145 likes, and Call of Duty Infinite Warfare has 2,552,268. Wait, what? Six? Oh, oh. 67 likes. I, I didn't know I already disliked it, but... So, pretty substantial difference. 2 million... 2.5 million dislikes. 1.7 million likes. And, on top of that, Battlefield 1's trailer also has... F um... I think... Four... I mean... 11, 11 million more views, which is a lot. Um, but people generally like Battlefield 1 better, but I, I've i seen a video by this guy named Blue Drake 42 I haven't watched any of his other videos. I just found him while browsing around. And he has this pretty cool video on a leak, a supposed leak. And this looks pretty pretty official. Now, this is supposedly... A screenshot, well, a, a screen photoshop, like someone took a digital camera and then just p captured their screen, not not on the screen, but took a photo of their TV or monitor, that's what I'm trying to say, and it looks pretty official, um, so here we can see, um, primary weapon, I'm not gonna try to say that, an optic, an accessory, Apparent. I see... Maybe those are classes or subclasses, inf infantryman, an officer. And then you see, oh, and on the right you also see an ACOG site thing. And below the white text, and yellow text or orange text, I don't know, I'm color deficient. ACOG site only available to customers who purchase the BF4 favorite add-on pack. $59.99. Um, so what does this mean? What, and is this advertising? I, is this a microtransaction? We're not exactly sure. I'm pretty sure. Um, this is basically just microtransactions, and it's incorporated into the game, which is the worst part. E I know this is still a beta, or an, um, probably a pre-alpha or something like that. But no, no Call of Duty or Battlefield game should have ads, even if it's for themselves. You'd think that you're, since you're playing the game, you would be already thinking about those things. Like, you you don't see, like, um, only, like, right next to a weapon in, like, a black market or whatever in Call of Duty, it doesn't say only available through supply drops in big letters and telling you how much a supply drop is to buy. That, you don't do that. You just don't. And Battlefield has stayed away from this. I... I personally like Battlefield 4 more than Black Ops 3, and I, I own both games, so I'm entitled to my own opinion. Um, but this is what concerns me. Add-on pack. First, it's it's $60, which is going to be the base price of the game. Let's, let's look up the Battlefield 1. Oh, okay, I'm a bad typer. Battlefield 1. So, pre-order. So, it's... This is the early enlister edition. If I go on Origin right here. Um... Okay, can I just find that regular one? Battlefield. Battle... Battlefield. Please. Let me, let me find this. You know what? Forget it. Well, I'm I'm guessing it's sixty dollars. Only early enlister version is eighty or something. So, 
an add-on pack for the game, basically an ex expansion pack, or a pro I wouldn't call it DLC. DLC usually refers to something bigger, like a map pack and some new weapons. These are just weapon attachments, and they're they're sixty dollars for weapon attachments. That's that's really unbelievable to me. If uh, um, and there's also a second photo. Is this the one? Uh, where's the second photo? Is this the second photo? Oh, yes. So here is the small MX2. Um, so this, I'm guessing, is a bolt-action rifle, or a sh it's not a shotgun. <laughs> um, and again, we see add-on pack on here. This, um, this is really what makes the title of the video, hashtag grip BF. Battlefield 1. Well, I guess just hashtag rip PF. And I don't want this microtransaction to be in my game, frankly. If I buy this game, I'm, I just, um, I have my karate graduation. So I did earn a little bit of money for that. And I'm not sure if I'm going to pre-order this game or not. Just because of this. I, I saw this literally last night, I think. Maybe two days ago. But point is I don't want microtransactions to be in my in a game like this and better yet even worse add microtransactions that's that's why I don't like most mobile games because they self advertise themselves and advertise other things and no one else wants to see it whenever I see an ad I don't think hey I want to buy that product I think hey I want to kill myself you can quote that if you want, obviously. Well, I get. I guess that's it for the video. Um, I'm I'm a little bit excited for um, Call of Duty Infinite Warfare. I I still like future games. I'm a little tired of them at this point. I like Destiny. I kind of like Black Ops Three. I really really like Advanced Warfare though. Um, so just tell me what got. Tell me what you guys think. This video might get a lot of views because it's about Call of Duty. And thank you for watching.